Hi friends, welcome back to another video. Welcome to a shop with me video. I'm really curious to see what is out in the stores for spring decor. So I plan to stop at Home Goods, Kirkland's, and Target. And if I have enough time, I'm gonna also try to stop at Hobby Lobby. I'm hoping I have enough time for Hobby Lobby because I'm really curious to see what they have. Um, but they're just a little bit further of a drive. Um, so I'm not sure if I will make it. But I'm at Home Goods right now, and Kirkland's is literally right next to Home Goods. And so far, the parking lot looks pretty, pretty empty considering how Home Goods is typically quite busy. So Hopefully it's not too busy inside, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Give it a thumbs up if you cannot wait for spring to get here and let's go shopping. It's been a while since I have shopped at Home Goods, so it's really nice to stop in and see what they had. I love that Home Goods gets new shipments each week, so it's you, whenever you visit, it seems like things have changed. Like there's always new things available. They had a lot of spring florals, a lot of their spring wreaths were out. Also your typical Easter decor. Um, I saw a lot of kind of old world style vases and the earth tones and I love that look. I'm such a fan of that look lately. Um, and I also stopped by the furniture section I always have to scope out their furniture whenever I shop home goods because you just never know what you're gonna find. And I've recently been searching for some new bar stools for our kitchen island. They had a lot of nice options, but nothing was completely calling out my name. I will know it when I see it, so I'm gonna keep looking. They did have a couple console tables that caught my eye. I've been on the hunt for a new table for my foyer. Um, my husband, he's not a fan of the home goods furniture. He thinks it's not great quality. I think for the price, it's a good deal, but let me know what you guys think down in the comments. I loved pretty much everything in Kirkland's. They have such a nice selection right now, but nothing was on sale. I think the only thing on sale was the artwork. So I'll come back on another day when they're having a sale. I just saw so many pieces that I wanted. So I'm keeping a list and I'll be continually checking online for when things go on sale.
whenever shopping at Target, of course you have to check out the dollar spot area. Mine was picked over, but I did find a couple cute items I thought would be perfect. Easter basket fillers, especially if you have a teenage daughter. They even had some options for young kids as well. Next, I stopped by the Threshold by Studio McGee department in the Hearth and Hand area, of course. They had a lot of nice options. I was seeing a lot of that old world style that is definitely trendy right now. I was in love with a lot of the pillow options in the Threshold um, department. In fact, I'm thinking I'll probably go back and purchase a couple items that I missed. While I'm editing this video, I'm seeing quite a few items that that are catching my eye that I didn't see when I was in person. Um, but a lot of baskets are very, very popular right now for spring, a lot of basket trays, and even just baskets for storing throw blankets and things like that. I also saw a some throw blankets that were dupes for, that are dupes for the Barefoot Dreams blanket. Not the same quality as the Barefoot Dreams, but definitely very soft and has that similar look. Um, and then finally, I stopped by the linens department, checking out what tablecloths they had available. They were picked over at my Target, but again, I'm gonna go online and see if there is more selection there.
Okay guys, I just finished up at Target and I have to say I was a little disappointed in my Target store. I feel like they need to do a better job of decluttering their shelves and making things more presentable. My OCD was seriously kicking in and I wanted so badly to just reorganize things for them and you know decorate the shelves because they just looked so messy. But they did have a lot of nice things. I just think mine was probably overpicked. So I'm gonna go online and see if I can find more things in stock online. Um, and I was a really good girl. I didn't buy a whole lot. I want to shop around a little more before I really buy anything. Um, I did find one thing at Home Goods that I hope works out. I'm going to take it home and see how it looks with my decor. And if I don't return it, I'll share that with you guys in another video. Um, but I'd love to stop by not only Hobby Lobby, but I'd also like to um, eventually go over to Pottery Barn. Um, I'll have to save that for another shopping trip. Hobby Lobby is about 25 minutes from here, so unfortunately, I just did not give myself enough time to head over there, so another day, another shopping trip, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Give it a thumbs up if you did, subscribe if you're new, and I hope you have an absolutely wonderful day. I will see you soon in my next one. Take care.